Hey Alexa, what's the temperature today? Right now, it's 30 degrees Fahrenheit. Tonight, expect a low of 19 degrees. No! Alexa, I don't want to go outside. Alexa, I need motivation. Here is a quote from Barack Obama. The best way to not feel hopeless is to get up and do something. Don't wait for good things to happen to you. If you go out and make some good things happen, you will fill the world with hope. You will fill yourself with hope. Hey guys, welcome to another episode of LJ's Garage. I'm not normally one for excitement. My voice doesn't change a whole lot. I kind of stay about right there. Meh is what I like to call it. But if I were an excited person, which I'm pretty excited right now, but if I were to show that excitement, it would be something like this. So normally, that's how I would celebrate. I'd do my little dancey dance, which is, you know, what you guys just saw. That was a song by Pop Smoke. If you guys don't know who Pop Smoke is, go ahead and look into him. But with all that being said, celebration out of the way, I just want to thank you guys so much for the continued support. I know that the videos have been kind of different lately, and I'll get into all that later if you guys care. But as far as right now, I wouldn't have made it this two years without all of you guys, every single one of you. You guys matter, you guys count, like literally every single one of you counts as a subscriber. So, you know, when I say that you guys count, genuinely, I mean that. And I love filming cars and I love being on YouTube and I love doing this stuff. It's super, super fun. However, as you guys know, it's nice every now and then to have a little bit of a measure of success, as you could call it. Um, would I stop doing it if I didn't have the success? No. Does it make it so much easier? Hell effing yeah. So that's why I stopped to thank you guys, and I hope that your 2021 has started off fantastic. And by that I mean I hope all that your wishes and dreams and hopes and everything that you left in 2020 stays in 2020. And you guys are off to a great start this year. If you're not, don't worry. We still have a whole year. Well, sh Oh, excuse me. Uh, we have a whole like two days and 11 months, whatever the math is. I don't know how many days are in January. Doesn't matter. My calendar tells me, so I don't need you guys to tell me right now how many days are in January. Doesn't matter. In the next coming week, I plan to do a car update, car updates, give you guys a little garage tour, everything that's going on. Right now, the weather really, really sucks. As you can see from my intro clip, I hate the cold. I have Florida blood, Jamaica blood, island blood, all that good stuff. So it does not like the cold. I am struggling right now with the cold and struggling with a lot of other stuff that's not related to cars at all, but I won't get into that, won't bore you guys, but know that things will return back to normal once I return back to normal, and then the videos will continue, and I'll be able to leave the house and feel okay, and, you know, get in front of a camera and entertain you guys, as I love doing so much. But right now I'm an introvert, and so as much as you might think that being in front of this camera is an awesome thing that I love doing, and it's so easy, and just whatever, it's not. And if you know anything about introverts, I'll tell you this, being around people, even though this is a camera, is tiring. So right now I've been recharging for the last couple months and yeah, uh, yeah, it's kind of taken a long time to recharge, but I will, trust me, as soon as spring rolls around. And if not, I guess I'll have to find some warm weather or buy some warmer clothes and just kind of suck it up and do it. I did take the Jeep snow drifting, so that was kind of cool. I did leave the house at one point. I'll throw some footage in here. It's really not that spectacular. Inside the car, it feels a lot faster than it is when you're filming and you see the film. It doesn't look that cool, but I'm gonna edit it and throw it in here so it looks kind of epic. And, you know, essentially I'm a badass, but I'm saying that to you guys, it might not look as cool, so, you know, it's whatever. Plus, the Jeep's like 5,000 pounds, so there's that, and then it's not that fast, it's just a V6. So, I mean, there's other things. I'm not making excuses or nothing, it doesn't matter, but I'm just saying this footage is kind of cool, so there's that. <laughs> The other thing I want to say is that yes, last year I did do a bunch of bouncing around. I went from St. Louis to Saint and the I went from St. Jesus. I went from St. 
let's try this again, but slower. I went from St. Louis, that area, to San Antonio, that area, to Ohio, the Dayton area. And so I'm still kind of bouncing around, finding myself, finding cars, finding that network, finding that community. And so I've been welcomed pretty well into the Dayton car scene. And I'm excited to kind of branch out, make some more friends, do all those things, and more of those cars that I enjoy. A lot of the cars that I've been doing lately have been boring. They've been adult cars. They've been A to B cars. And I want to get back into some of those performance cars and some of those tuned cars and modded cars and all that stuff. However, it's kind of a hard thing to do when it's below 30 degrees outside. I barely take my M3 out. I can't imagine someone else is going to take their twin turbo Lamborghini out here on summer tires and bother with all that. So it's kind of hard to get cars, but that will return. But that's all I have for you guys. Thank you for 5,000 subscribers, and I cannot wait to see where we go next. Couldn't have done this without you guys. It's a team effort. And uh, yeah, if you got any ideas, feedback, anything, drop it down below. But anything you got, feel free to share. You guys, a lot of you have hit me up on Instagram. A lot of you guys have sent me emails talking about cars, whatever it may be. I'm a pretty chill person. As long as you don't say anything weird or do anything weird, I'm open to whatever you can throw at me. I feel like I need a disclaimer on that. I'll talk to my lawyer. But in the meantime, just go ahead and, you know, let's network, let's, let's be friends. And on that note, this is where the video ends. Thank you guys. And until next time, which will be real soon, be easy, be safe, stay healthy, stay sane, most importantly. And LJ, we'll see you on the next one. Peace.